There are some people who do not believe in legends. And these very people would never believe that sometimes, under special circumstances, even a chicken can become a great hero. And so it came that nobody paid any special attention to the birth of a small, nameless creature a long time ago, far in the east, in a very dark and dangerous place, deep, deep underground. Are you the small chicken who lost his parents? You must feel very lonely. Come, let's do something together. Mm. Let's go. This way. We need to get over the crates. Phew! That was close. This is the room. Lucky for us, they left the door open. Come! We'll check what they keep in there. I wonder what's in there. I've seen something like this before. Let's see if I can play it. Want to fight? Want to be a rebel, yes? I told you, General. When you look the other way for only a moment, they'll start making problems. You're the one responsible for security, Captain. If the Emperor hears of this, there will be consequences. Well, but uh, he doesn't have to hear about this. Uh, we simply treat him the same way as all other troublemakers and done, right? Well? well of course. Those who cause trouble in the mines lose all their <laughs> rights. And finally, their life. No! And now to you. So, you... like music?
Hey, you! Finally! After all these years! Can you hear me? Probably not. How should he? He would need to be a Shaolin to do that. But hey, I don't have any... Unbelievable! You can hear me? Only the old Shaolin masters were able to hear the spirits. You have much potential. I can help you to escape from the cave. To do that, however, you need to free me. Pick up one of those bones lying around. Use it to smash my cage! It is great to be free again! Even if I miss my body. Many thanks, young friend. We should hurry to get out of these caves. The screamers will gnaw on anything that looks remotely edible. I can protect you with my powers. Call upon me when you need my help. But be warned. Once my power has been drained, I will need some time to replenish it. The water shield will protect you for a short while. Beware, though. If it takes too much damage, it will collapse before it expires. <clears throat> can be deadly, yet we have to cross it. Activate my power! Then I'll be able to protect you from the lava. But do hurry! The lava will quickly drain my power! I know you're exhausted, but don't give up now! We have almost reached the exit! Can this be? I just heard something. That one is still very young, and yet he made it all the way here. Maybe he is the... Hmm. Did you practice the forbidden techniques again? Even though you've reached the second grade of Shaolin today, that does not entitle you to fight. I'm not tolerating combat training in my monastery, especially not on your day off. On the other hand, you didn't break anything in a whole week. And as a small reward, I'll... My congratulations. Um... Are you thinking about that girl from your childhood again? You should forget about her. She's on her own now.
We are chickens. We can't meddle with the affairs of the great and powerful. It's about time you learn that. Uh. And don't pester me again with the question why you are not allowed to train in a Shaolin monastery. You are well aware that we haven't done any sparring here since the day Master Chi Ken has left us. Under my administration, we dedicate ourselves to meditation and nothing else. No fighting. No ball games. No strolling. Nothing. Except today, on your day off. Hmm. Enjoy it. But don't you dare to break anything. Principal Lee still has an eye on you, and that's because you always cause trouble. Hey, listen! I think there's someone at your door. Hello, hello, hello! I heard you received your second grade today, and someone must have been thinking of you. A delivery is waiting for you at the storehouse. Follow the vases to find the storehouse. You know, the things that are so much fun smashing. The Forbidden Hall! Almost looks like in the old days. With the exception that someone turned it into a dusty storeroom. But we'll fix that in a minute. Use my powers to make some light. Quick! Light up two torches! of this monastery. Once, the noble fighting art of the Shaolin was practiced here. The monks were brave and wise, and opposed the cruel emperor. That's how it used to be, and that's how it could be again. If a chicken could be found with the heart of a tiger. You want to go out into the world? To help? To protect? To find a lost love? Then you need to learn a few things. Listen and heed my words. What kind of splendid things did they teach you so far? Cooking? Cleaning? Plucking parsley? It's high time that you learn something useful. Go and find the old tablets of lore and bring them to me. Yes, 
This is one of the tablets. Hold it closer to the light. Oh no! What have you done, you clumsy fool? Now you'll never learn the secret techniques. <laughs> After a hundred years of imprisonment, a little joke was in order. <laughs> Any decent master can teach you the technique of focus just like that. You just have to become one with the liquid self of matter and time. Come on, it's not that difficult. There you go. And now bring me the second tablet. That shouldn't be so difficult now. Oh. Ah yes! The technique of sequenced attacks. By specially timed and coordinated attacks, you can synchronize impetus as well as traction and recoil forces, enabling you to, uh... Ah, oh, well, you're not going to get it anyway. Just attack several times in quick succession and try to find the rhythm. Then the strikes will become more powerful. Get going! Yes! <laughs> well done! Watch out! You would cause trouble again. So many years I had an eye on you, and yet you still haven't understood a thing. Master Chi Ken left us after the Emperor's armies raised all the other monasteries. We are chickens. We don't fight. If there is danger, we run away, screaming in all directions. Is that clear? What you see in this hall is the past, and it will never return. Mm -mm. But you would rather fight, wouldn't you? Oh, just the thought of it gives me a severe headache. Let me remind you of our task. We take care of the poor children that get discarded from the mine. Like we did with you all those years ago. That's already more than enough for my blood pressure. Mm-hmm. Oh, no. I know that look in your eyes. You still want to find that girl. Well, I'm not going to support you in such a foolish task. The only one who could truly help you would be Master Chi Ken. So, if you want to descend into the Ghost Dragon Forest to search for the Master, who left us so that we would be safe, a fact that I'd like to point out again and again, then please, be my guest. But my blessing for this daft quest, I'll give you not. And I warn you, the Ghost Dragon Forest is a dangerous and cursed place. Oh, if only someone would actually listen to me. Now look at that! An old shrine of exchange! In the old days, traders would deposit items here, uh, which would be useful to warriors in need. You took what you required, and in turn, left money for the trader. 
I wonder if that still works. <laughs> <laughs>